What's up guys? My name is Sid and welcome back to my channel. Alright, so for today's vlog, kakaibang vlog ang mangyayari today because hindi lamang ito travel that you usually see me in mukbang, okay, mga Q&A or anything. But today is a special day, especially for everyone sa lahat ng mga kabaklaan out there. Kasi today is the day kung saan ikokoronahan ang bagong Miss Universe 2020. Ako, yes, totoo, 2020 kahit 2021 na ngayon kasi because of the pandemic, hindi pa natuloy kahapon, ay kahapon, hindi na tuloy yung ating Miss Universe 2020. And right now, we are really, really rooting for Miss Rabia Mateo from the Philippines. Exciting, exciting. Kaya kung nga mapapansin mo ngayon, ako ay nakasuot ng Pilipinas kahit masikip na. <laughs> Sige, suot natin laban. No matter what happens, Rabia, we are still proud of you kasi nakikita namin talaga yung effort and talagang lahat ginagawa mo for you to get our fifth crown for the Philippines. And I'm really, really excited. Kaya ngayon, kahit ako ay uh, hilo-hilo pa kasi bagong gising lang kasi 8am po today ang ating Miss Universe I am really excited and energized for me to be able to watch and witness the crowning of the new Miss Universe 2020 I'm really excited for the girls to go all out at ibibigay nila yung fight of their lives please do not forget to subscribe, like, share, comment and please do not forget to click the notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa aking future vlogs and future uploads so with that, ayan, pak na pak na Now, let's start! Ayan na, so Malaysia na, let's go. Malapit na ang Philippines. Yan na! Peru! Woo! Philippines! Ayan! Top 21! Top 21! The first contestant moving into the semifinals is... Woo! Colombia! Colombia! Peru! Peru! Next, sino pa yan? Australia, pasok! Myanmar, nakapasok. Uy, pasok si Jamaica. Mexico! Mexico! Alam nyo, kudos talaga sa Miss Universe Organization because syempre hindi madali na mag-organize ng ganitong event at these times pa na pandemic. Oh, so right now, by the way, naka-zoom tayo with MCC Open Table. Nakakatawa kasi this is a church in the Philippines that welcomes the LGBT+. Kaya I'm so happy na nandito tayo sa Zoom viewing party with them. Ang meaning pala ng MCC Open Table is Yes, Metropolitan Community Church. Filipina! The next delegate in the top 21 is... Nakakaba. Dominican Republic. Dominican Republic. Republica El Dominicana. Ayan na! Sana Philippines na... USA! USA. Sana Philippines na... Indonesia! Indonesia! Argentina! Argentina! Sana Philippines na, guys! India! India, yes. Curacao. Curacao. Sana Philippines na. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Second group na. Just go, Lord. Philippines, sana pumasok ka na. Oo, oh, Canada. Hindi pa siya nagkatawa. Oh, yeah. Nagchichikahan na sila. <laughs> Canada nga, wala. Yes, pumasok. Yan na, yan na. Yan na, yan na. We're back. Philippines. Philippines. Oh, oh, Philippines. This is Rabia Oksana Mateo, all the way from the Philippines. Oh, fuck. I really had my humble beginnings and education. Pasok si Rabia! And just for... Now, I am a teacher. Ganda, oh, fuck. Woo, Philippines! Oh, Brazil. Trending actually si Olivia sa Twitter ngayon, number two. Oh, kasi bakit kaya ganitong energy ni Olivia Kulik? Great Britain? Great Britain? Kumanta! <laughs> ah, singer siya. Ay, nag-X-Factor siya. Basta ako happy-happy na akong pumasok si Philippines, Pilipinas, para sa thumbnail. Yes, Thailand, of course. Okay, dahil tayo yung medyo nakahinga-hinga na, magkape muna tayo. O, di ba? Coffee ko. Hindi ito sponsor, pero coffee ko, baka yan naman. I'm not a coffee person, by the way, pero I needed this para lalong kabahan siya. So, ayan, nakapasok ko si Vietnam. Kape-kape muna tayo. Wala si South Africa at si Kasi. OMG, oo nga. Wala si South Africa at Nepal. Also, nag-nag si Venezuela. 
Oh, yes. Yes. Wala... lang ako sa mga oh, chika sa mga bakla. <laughs> laban, laban Pilipinas. <laughs> swimsuit round na, swimsuit competition. Let's go. Laban na laban si Jamaica, oh. Pa, oh, pa. Mexico. Mexico is good. Dominican Republic. Oh, mata na si Dominican Republic. <laughs> USA! Yes! Indonesia! Ang ganda! India! Ganda? Pero parang laging galit si India. Galit ka ba girl? Si Kurosa wala talaga to sa radar ko at all. Baka ginalingan niya talaga sa closed door interview. Puerto Rico! Pa, ganda oh! Those hips! Oh! Ganda! Oh! Go Philippines! Grabe! Lumalaban din talaga si Rabia. Ma'am Shi, let's go! Alam mo yung tipo naglalakad siya tapos parang may hangin dito sa book niya. Wow! Para siyang ano, Victoria's Secret Angel. And excited na ako makapasok siya sa top 10 para makita natin kung anong itsura ng gown niya! Nicaragua, ba? Ganda ni Thailand, ba? Costa Rica! Viva! Go Vietnam! This is Miss Universe Live on FBI! Ayan, drum pa ng mga bakla. Ah! magkakat na sila to 10. Tapos, yung top 10 will be going straight sa ating long gown competition. So, laban, Rabia. You did very well. Sana makapasok ka para makita natin yung gown mo. And sana makapasok ka sa top 5 para marinig ng universe kung gano'ng kakagaling. Pag nakapasok na siya sa top 5, okay na ako doon. Laban. Let's go. Ayan na! Ayan na! Ayan na! Okay. So, ngayon, ay uh, mag announce na sila ng top 10 for this year. Ang top 21 are the following. Colombia, Peru, Australia, France, Myanmar, Jamaica, Mexico, Dominican Republic, USA, Indonesia, Argentina, India, Curacao, Puerto Rico, Philippines, Brazil, Great Britain, Nicaragua, Thailand, Costa Rica, and Vietnam. Pero ngayon, since nailabas na yung list and natapos na yung swimsuit round, nakapag-create na din ako ng top 10 list ko na sana ito na talaga ang makakapasok for the next round. For me, ang top 10 based from their swimsuit round, Philippines, Thailand, Colombia, Indonesia, Brazil, Brazil, Jamaica, India, Australia, Puerto Rico, and Peru. So, meron tayong ano dito, parang pa Q&A. At kung sino daw ang ano, mananalo ng 200 pesos Gcash. How many times daw si MJ Lastimosa? Three times. Oh, diba? Pak! Nanalo tayo! 200 pesos din na ano yun na Gcash. <laughs> Ayan na! Top and the first na. question in the top 10 is Jamaica. Jamaica, paso. Our second spot goes to Dominican Republic. Yes. India. Yes, India. Fourth spot is Philippines. Peru. 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 Spot number five belongs to Australia. Australia, yes, magaling sa Australia. Puerto Rico. Puerto Rico. Puro Latina ang mga pumapasok ha. Ayun, Thailand. Pasok si Thailand. Oy, Philippines! Costa Rica! Costa Rica! Diyos ko! Mexico! Mexico. Ayan na, Philippines na to. Iuhuli pa ba nila si Philippines? Only one spot remains. Brazil! Ay, walang Philippines! Go, Brazil! <laughs> so that's it. Wala na. Di ba sok ng Pilipinas? I-announce na nila yung best in national costume. Costume winner was... Myanmar! Oh, Myanmar! Sila po ang ating top 10 for this year's 2020's Miss Universe. Sad lang kasi hindi nakapasok si Philippines, di ba si Rabia? But Rabia fought really, really hard and binigay niya talaga yung best niya. Kaya kudos still to you, Miss Rabia Mateo of the Philippines. Uh, you did very, very well and you made everyone here in the Philippines very, very proud. Babawi tayo next year. The Evening Gown Parade. Woohoo!
Sayang si Indonesia, ganda ng gaon, no? Ah, si Albania. Yan na po si Philippines. Aura-aura na lang sa likod. Opa, pag-ikot na lang. Let's see Jamaica. Jamaica, asan ka? Hoy, Jamaica! Ayun! Kalit ni Jamaica! Dominican Republic. Dominican Republic's gown meh na India yung sinot ni India is the same gown that she wore during the preliminary competition Peru Peru let's go Peru mas maganda sana yung kunaka straight hair Papa Puerto Rico I love it French gown let's go Thailand Costa Rica's gown wow red By the way, opinion ko lamang to ha. Baka mabash tayo. Mexico's gown! Ano to? What's this? Ala, parang lumapad siya sa gown. Let's see Brazil. It's also a blue gown. Ang uh, pinaka bet na bet ko talaga is si Peru and India. Mexico! Yes! Mexico, pasok! India! Yes! Bumibingo ako ha! Baka bumalang si Philippines! Next! Philippines! Alam, pandaya yun kung pumasok si Philippines. Peru! 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 Opa! Ah! Brazil! Dalawa na lang! Dominican Republic! Peru! Final question round! Exciting! So once again, ito na yung ating top 5. Dominican Republic, India, Peru, Mexico, and Brazil. So sad to say na wala ang Philippines. Pero still, gumaban talaga si Bacala. Ito na. Wala. If you were the leader of your country, May echo. Parang nakakaraok si Brooklyn. How would you have handled COVID with the COVID-19 pandemic? I believe there's not a perfect way to handle this hard situation such as COVID-19. However, I believe that what I did done was create the lockdown even before everything was that big. Lagut! Because we lost so many lives and we cannot afford that. We have to take care of our people. That's why I would have taken care of them since the beginning. Lagut, Mexico, lag lag. India, Europe. Should countries lock down due to COVID-19 despite the strain on their economies or should they open their borders and risk a potential increase in infection rates? Perfect question for India. Good evening universe. Coming from India and witnessing what India is experiencing right now, I have realized something very important. That nothing is more important than your health of your loved ones. And you have to draw a balance between economy and health. And that can only be done when the government works with the people hand in hand and produces something that will work with the economy. Thank you. Bye! Brazil! Good evening, universe! Number one. Number one. In many countries, women are still considered incapable of being world leaders. Convince these countries that they're wrong. Women are such an important part of this society and just because we are not encouraged in the same way that it means are, like we, are have, we have our potential wasted the world needs women contributions because we came for some reason and i invite every woman to understand that we are the leaders of our lives and yes we can do a yes. lot for our communities so please take your power Dominican Republic. Explain the importance of teaching leadership to young girls. How would you do that as Miss Universe? Ganda din ko. La noche que ganó Miss Universo. So si... Siya lang nga so far si Dominican Republic ang naging interpreter. Vengo de una familia completamente llena de mujeres. I come from a family completely filled with women. De las cuales me he impulsado para ayudarlas hoy día. Of which have helped me, propelled me to help them today. Trabajando con mi organización sin fines de lucro, el Fanato Niños de Cristo. Working with my nonprofit, uh, Fines de Cristo. 
Entiendo que no tengo que tener un título para ayudar a todas aquellas niñas necesitadas a enseñarles cómo ser libre. I understand that I don't need a title to be able to help others and to be able to support them. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. What would you say to the woman watching tonight who are currently experiencing sexual or domestic abuse? I will tell them that I admire their strength. Wow. That they're survivors and that I've been there too. I became the hero of my own story. That's why I advocate to save little girls from being victims. They're survivors, they're heroes. They have the power and don't ever, ever make anyone silence your voice. Wow! It's time for the final statement. Mexico! Changing beauty standards. Vivimos en una sociedad está más avanzada. We live in a society that more and more and more is more and 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 more in our hearts and the way that we conduct ourselves. No permitan nunca que alguien les diga que no tienen valor. Never permit someone to tell you that you're not valuable. Ganda. Free speech and the right to protest. Right to protest. We've seen many protests in the recent days. Especially I want to point out the protests that women have made throughout the years with equal rights. Until today we lack in them. Because protest helps us raise our ah, what's happening against inequality. It helps minorities in any democracy to raise their voice. So the protest is very important. But what's not important is when you use it, because with every right comes a responsibility. So use it with power. Mental health. Mental health is still a very stigmatized topic, and it keeps us from giving the right assistance to those in need. So may we all tonight remember to normalize conversations wow. about anxiety or Pero depression. Because we all hurt sometimes, but we don't need to face it alone. May we all come together because togetherness is our strength and together we can overcome anything. So let's support each other, let's wow. share empathy. Thank you. During this pandemic, Mi país, República Dominicana. My country, Republic of the Dominican Republic. Asumió el 23% en pobreza. Has risen to 23% poverty rate. Para mí, estar aquí al frente de ustedes, pudiendo representar a la República Dominicana. For me, being able to be in front of you guys, representing the Dominican Republic. Es un, un gran orgullo poder decir que va a ayudar a nuestro turismo, que nosotros los seres humanos that, that makes me incredibly proud that it will help my tourism and that us as human beings tenemos que tener en cuenta que son muchas personas que están allá afuera que los podemos Oye, ayudar over na, over time na Dominican Republic and we have to realize there are so many people out there that need our help and that we can overcome anything gracias thank you thank you very much Perú. climate change it is our collective responsibility to start taking action in order to save our planet. Wow. Just by the little by little, we can start making a difference. Little by little, by recycling, by teaching young generations about taking care of our beautiful, Pero. beautiful <laughs> earth. We're just here for one time. And this is the time that we have to start taking care of it. Thank you. Pero Mexico pa din for me. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Zosie as she takes her final walk as Miss Universe. Tingnan ng gown ni Zosie. Final walk na ni Miss Zosie. Wow. She looks like she looks like an African princess or African queen. Third runner up. Ah, Dominican Republic. Third runner up is India. India. Sabi na. Our Mexico. Miss Universe is Peru! Ah! No! The winner of the 69th 
Ang weird! Chai, tinan mo! Ang layo ng how! Mexico! Mexico! Oo. We were really rooting for Peru, pero deserve din naman ni Mexico yung crowd. Naku, din nagmas pa sila. Wala lang social distancing. At dyan po nagtatapos yung ating vlog reaction para sa ating Miss Universe 2020. Nalungkot lang ako kasi, syempre, una sa lahat, hindi nakapasok yung ating uh, pambato na si Miss Philippines. Aww. And at the same time, another na kinalungkutan ko kasi we were really rooting for Miss Peru. I don't know what happened. Congratulations to all the winners. Please do not forget to like, subscribe, share, comment, and please do not forget to click the notification notification bell para lagi kayong updated sa aking future vlogs and future uploads. So with that, see you on my next vlog. Bye!